Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. Another sign, in my opinion, of earth changes that are coming. Volcanic eruptions, earthquakes that are going to be increasing. Here we had a magnitude 5.5 earthquake along the Cameroon line. It's a line of islands and in my opinion, it was formed as a hot spot slowly moved northeast. Much like uh, the uh, Canary Islands and the Yellowstone hotspot, you know, as it came up from uh, California, Oregon, moved up through the Snake River Plateau and where it is now. Uh, many uh, scientists believe that these islands were formed from recycled magma coming up from a plume. Nine people reported feeling this earthquake. Um, it was about 6.2 miles in depth or 10 kilometers. And if you follow the line of the islands, it ends at Mount Cameroon, which is the tallest mountain in West Africa. It stands over 4,095 meters high. That is 13,000, over 13,000 feet high. Here's another image of it on Twitter. It is near the Gulf of Guinea and is the fourth most prominent peak in Africa. It poses a threat to over a half a million people in the area this volcano and very little is known about its magma chamber they haven't done basically any research about it the magma chamber is about 20 to 30 kilometers um, underneath this volcano they figure the magma chamber is between 12 and 19 miles underneath um, yeah this dangerous volcano that's the main magma chamber but there's other pockets of magma chamber much shallower some might be as shallow as 1.8 miles below the surface. Being one of the most active volcanoes in Africa, on nature.com they have an image and an article about past eruptions. 1999, 2000, 1982, 1922, 1954, 2009, and 1959. On Volcano Discovery they have a list of the last uh, earthquakes. Uh, yeah, in the last 24 hours. I'll pull this over a little bit and you can see they have this uh, magnitude 5.5 uh, listed here. Um, yeah, what was these earthquakes? Uh, they show on December 19th a magnitude 5.5 off the northwest coast. You can see the different magnitudes, I guess, and guess them here. USGS doesn't show any other earthquake in the last 30 days other than this one today, the magnitude 5.5. A paper on Springer says the African continent, though not always associated with seismic events, is currently considered as a seismic prone region. This is because of the rising magnitude and intensity of seismic activity in the continent within the past century. Because of the civil unrest that is ongoing there the corruption that's ongoing there yeah you think about the infrastructure um, the collapse of buildings and yeah the deaths that would happen from a large earthquake and yeah earthquake monitoring there in Africa is not a priority at all so it's real interesting about this Cameroon line as they call it here on Wikipedia they have an article about it this area includes the Gulf of Guinea uh, and mountains that extend along the border in the region of eastern Nigeria and western Cameroon and Mount Cameroon on the Gulf of Guinea north and northeast of Lake Chad. So what are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you for subscribing. Uh, thank you for your support. Everyone have a very Merry Christmas and I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.